Now then, which chest will you open? This one. Terra leaf. Which chest do you want to open next? So now I need to find a Terra leaf. Let's go. You did it. Get another chance. This one. Terra leaf again. Are these all Terra leaves? What would be the point if all these are Terra leaves? Mana leaf. Next one is your last chance. So I want to look pure leaf. So it's not this one or it's not this one. One of these three. I'm going for this one. Dang it. That's it, game over. I got a Thera leaf. Yeah, I'm doing this again. Probably can't really get much besides these leaves and seeds and stuff, but you know, still pretty good. Pure leaf. Wait, are these the same? Are these carried over? Hold up. This was mana, right? Oh, these are just carried over. It looks like. I think. I think they're the exact same treasures. Hmm, okay, I get it. So there's probably going to be more of these lucky chess games, and then they're going to have different items, basically. Alright, cool. So completing these shouldn't be too hard. Might just take a bit of trial and error. You open them all, you're going to put me right out of business. I got Mr. Chef. Come back and play again sometime. I bet you there are going to be more of those, and they're going to have, like, better items. Alright, key item? Where are my key items? Where, oh, where are my key items? There's no way to check key items in this game. There should be. Should be a way to look for key items. Personal? No, it's not personal. Not equipment. Score? Inventory. It's gotta be inventory. What is Mr. Chef? Oh! Stud card collection number one. Okay, so we have to get all these stud cards for something. First chapter of Wagner's Opera, Ring of the Nibelung. Magic stone, holy item. Fine. So we gotta get all these stud cards for something, probably. Anything else I can do here? We did the lucky chess game. Okay, where we fought Veronica is where the wolf is. Let's go grab that. Wait, is it past this guy? It might be past this guy. I'm surrounded. Oh, I got the... I surrounded them. I thought they surrounded me. I get the preemptive, which is great. Oh, beautiful. I love it when we're all just bundled together here. Everyone can join in the hail beat. Some talk to a publisher is nothing concrete. I was, of course, yeah. I was looking at chat. What did I expect? I was trying to read the message. Nothing concrete. Says things will not move quickly. Second is the composer. Oh, there's no, um... Okay, yeah. Second is the composer. Sugar is on. Mm, yeah, interesting. So, you know. That's basically a TBA as far as I'm concerned. here why are you thugs even here we dealt with the vigilante stuff but that was just for a chest so we got to go back somewhere up, 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 um. 
I have to go to where we fought Veronica, the fight of Wolf, and then we have a little... I think we have something else to check out over at La Havre, right? Before taking the boat to England. I wonder if this is going to be like the original Shadow Hearts, though. Because in the original Shadow Hearts, you, it was the, the Europe part and the Asia part. You were not able to go back to Asia. Because Asia was like the first part of the game. Everything up to Dehuai was the Asia part of the game. And you weren't able to go back to Asia after the Asia part. So the game is essentially divided into two. And you cannot go back to the Asia part. So there were like, there weren't many cycles in the Asian part of the game. But like, the parts that were the Asia part, you couldn't go back to once you once you were in Europe. But I wonder if that's going to be, I wonder if that's going to happen in Covenant. That might be the only thing that's like worrisome if that something like that happens. But can't really like recall if there's anything to do before then so like if there's like a cutoff for like hey you have to do everything now this thing is a hat <laughs> are you blanca <laughs> i finally found you well what do you know i'm famous i'm kelly i travel the world looking for strong wolves call me hungry enough boring talk let's let our fangs do the talking time for you to get a taste of my legendary skill sure you can handle it you're raring to go, aren't you? I've got plenty of that myself. Your name is Kelly. But you sound like a dude. Unless this is like where Ashley can actually be a boy name and Kelly can be a boy name. Because when I found out Ashley could be a boy name, I was shocked. To say the least. Go, Kelby. Yo, sick hat. Can I have that hat? Blanca will be able to rock that hat. I'll probably live another hit. Dodge, good dodge. Yeah, you don't do much damage. I'll be able to live another hit. No, not fast ring. Oh, great. That'll affect my healing, though. Uh, let's see if I can get this off. Oh, let's go. That was close. Ow. Uh, you're probably a combo away from death. But I don't really know if you are. Give me a phoenix tail. I didn't realize how big the AoE for phoenix tail was. Even if I don't kill you with a combo attack, like, you're low. I'm gonna hard hit you this time. Oh, it totally does look like a Terry Bogard hat. I didn't even think of that. It's totally Terry's hat. Basically, the same color scheme. Am I low on health? Are you gonna kill me here? I hope not. You got a crit. I'm still fine, though. Alright, these wolves don't do much damage. You are only fighting as Blanca, though. It's over. I win! Strike expand and a seal of luck. Not bad, not bad. No way! My fangs failed me! You got a little overzealous. You've got to keep your cool if you want to win. Damn, you're as strong as they say. Stronger, even. Okay, Blanca. Here's my paw print. You earned it. Hey, Soul Comet powered up. Yeah, Soul Comet powers up. Every time you get these, from what I read. It's guys like you that make street fighting such a rush. I'll be seeing you, and I'll have my fangs sharpened for next time. I wonder if I need these in order or not. I wonder if, like, you can just do them in any order or if you need them in a certain... You probably need them in a certain order. Alright, well. That's number two done. I love the stupid thing, Yuri. So we're done in the wine cellar. We just got some stuff to do in the Harvard right before going to England. Oh, 
Um. Karen was killing though with her combos. She only has two hits though. But Yuri can kill with two hits, so you know, I mean Yuri's just stronger than Karen is what it comes down to. Uh I don't know, hit the stug. Don't talk to me about that. What's this do now? Oh no, it's two hits. Hmm, interesting. Yo, that's so sick. Hey, yeah, get your combos ready. No, they're gonna combo. <laughs> they're getting my waifu. It's not okay. She's fine. You guys are all not close to each other. You know what? Two can play at that game. Oh, I wish at least two of you were near each other. You're gonna die from this, aren't you? So combo is probably pointless. Now you're still alive. I did it way too early. I don't know what I was thinking. I think I was confused. You know what? Can I run? Can, can I just run? This, this was a mistake. <laughs> I think I thought I was Karen and I was expecting fast ring, so I pressed it immediately. That's what happened. Back here. Yo, Gerard, I need, like, another tent or two. Might even want to buy Karen's weapon. Oh, no, she doesn't even have a weapon, Rip. Armor would be an interesting idea, although we're not really, like, having trouble. Stops mental break? Watch that stops all ring damage. This might be worth it to have, but that's a lot of money. I have 6,900, by the way, nice. Used by 50%, 25%. Bother with those. The ring speed is like perfectly fine in this game. Give me some tents, that's what I wanted. Like at least five. Man, if the other thing was cheaper, I would consider buying it. The, uh, the accessory. Yeah, this one, the pocket watch. I mean, I can afford this. I think I'm still better off buying this with a discount. Nice. The question is, who am I giving this to? Kind of anyone's pick, really. You have nothing, and I feel like you're the one mostly getting inflicted by them, so you get the pocket watch. Congrats. Alright, we should go back to Granny's house. We have a little side quest to start there. From what I researched before the stream, a lot of the side quests, like, some of them can be started, but a lot of them can't be, like, a lot of them are going to be, like, quests you're doing throughout the game. Like, a lot of them can't be finished till the end of the game, and some of them can be started as early as, like, this part. For example, well, the wolf bout with Blanca is a good example. But like, that's what some of the side quests are. Like, a lot of them are like, hey, you could start them, but like, you're not going to be finishing them till like the end of the game. Ah, there you all are. I've been waiting for you. The mayor came by and apologized. He promised to leave the shop alone from now on. I feel so much better. 
Did he really? He sure did. Said he'd forget about the tre treasure buried down there too. Now I can relax and think about business. We're so glad, glad Granny Lot. And we're getting that ship ride we wanted to. It all worked out great. Thank you for everything you've done. I'll be praying for your safe travel. Stop by if you ever come back this way again. Yo, Akeem, the children and I would all love to see you again. Granny, I want to talk to you. What is it? I'm going on that ship with them. What? I want to travel and build up my skills. And who knows, maybe I'll run into teacher somewhere along the way. Are you really sure you want to come along? There aren't any bad guys left in this town. My work here is done. Granny here rescued me once I was left for dead by the side of the road. I'm grateful, but now it's time to go. Ah, yes, no more need for friendly neighborhood, Joachim. Alright, Joachim, I remember when you were just dying, a dying bat, but you've certainly turned out fine. Off with you then, build up your skills, then come back and show me how strong you've become. Thank you, Granny. Thank you. You're kidding, right? Coming along with us won't be any fun, you know? I disagree. It'll be incredibly fun. Yuri, you do want to know who I really am, don't you? Well, yeah, I do, but plus it'll lead us to Keith. If you let me come along, maybe I'll tell you someday and tell us more about Keith. Son of a... Fine, do whatever you want. It's settled then. Thanks for letting me come along, everybody. This, in fact, settled. What is it, Granny? Here you are. This is all for you. Solomon's key. Yeah, this is a this is a side quest we can do more with. Selecting Solomon's key from the second page of the command menu displays an old map in a book entitled King Solomon's Key. Place the crest in the correct positions with each region to release the crest power and add. Ooh, fun! What's this? I did some digging on my own, you see, and that's when I found that book. You did some digging? When in the world did you do that, Granny? <laughs> I just had to find out what was down there. But the only thing I found was that old rotting book. I wish it were something more valuable. Oh my, this is incredible. You mean you know what that book is, Geppetto? No question about it, it's King Solomon's Key, one of the lost great black books. Not Nivelheim. This book contains a map where the 72 demons that were controlled by King Solomon lived. You know those crests we've been collecting along our travels? Crests. Oh, you mean the things I've got absolutely no use for? Those... The crest, you mean? Ah, yes, the game mechanic they don't let me use because I can fuse into demons. <laughs> you don't have to pout. Just because you can't equip them, you know. You're just a big baby. Mm, shut up. Excuse me, I'm talking here, folks, and I'm about to say something very important, kiddos, so listen up. It can't be that important if it's optional. They, they say that if we place the demons that dwell in these crests properly, we can unleash great magical power. Oh, I get it. We placed a crest on this old map, right? But how do we know where to place each crest? That's the question, isn't it? Maybe we can guess based on each demon's preferences and characteristics. But the trip ahead is long. I'm sure we'll figure it out eventually. Granny Lot, this is a true treasure indeed. Thank you very much. You're certainly welcome. I hope it'll be useful to you. Alright. Take a look at this. Oh yeah, you have to go to data. Or not data. You have to go to, um... Yeah, the second part of the menu to go to Kiedem. Yes, yeah, Solomon's Key has its own menu. Crest list. Hail of Trans, Enchanting Sea. What the heck does any of this even mean? I'm so... What is... Okay. Well, we're gonna have to mess with this, so... Anything else I can do besides the Solomon stuff? I think it's just that though. Hold up. Solomon. King Solomon's Key Trials. After you receive the key from Granny Lot, you can start filling in with the crest, yada yada. Place the crest is like solving a riddle based on the description of the monster living in the crest and the drawings in the key. Correctly placing all the crests in an area will power them up and add new spells. Filling in all the areas is important for the next portion. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> There's no way I'm going to be able to do this without any sort of guide. Filling in all the areas is important, yada yada. Blur, blur solutions. 
get this up. Press list. Is there a way to like see a description? Black clothed angel with silver hair and golden eyes lives close to Vipar, an art lover who talks with demons and in other areas. I can only do these four right now. Let's just not worry about this now. We have the key. We could probably do it whenever we want. Because it's in the menu. I think other than that, we're ready to go on with the story, though. There's nothing else to do. I also might want to switch some rings here. Yeah, like, maybe mess with the strike expand. I have two strike expands, three hit area expands. Give you the strike expands, I think. As for the hit area, we'll give it to you. That's good enough. 